morning. Right, welcome to Vape Mate. Uh, today we're going to do a short tutorial on mixing your own DIY e-liquids. Uh, it's cheap, it's easy, and it's fun to do. And uh, I'm going to get down on the desk and show you how to get one done. Right, so now we're down on the desk, we're going to do a bit of mixing. So, all the ingredients are already here and available on the Vape Mate website. We have, this is your nicotine, PG nicotine. Okay, got a little label on the side there. It is nasty stuff when it's in its concentrated form. Okay, keep all these ingredients, everything out of the way. Kids, pets, your mate who wants to nick your juice, just keep everything nice and safe and you'll be fine. Here we have a nice big bottle of VG. That's the good stuff that gives you the clouds. And then we have the PG. Very nice. Another one with a little label on it, so it needs to be kept nice and safe. And then, this is your flavour concentrate. Now this is my favourite, this is my vanilla custard. So we're going to uh, knock up a little bottle of vanilla custard and show you how, how we do it. So, I'm going to clear the decks and we will bring in a nice, clean, empty bottle. So you've got your bottle, your cap and your little, little spout. So, make sure you've got plenty of room and plenty of time. You don't want to be rushing this, all right? It's, uh, it's nice when it all goes well. So we're going to start off by putting in our nicotine. Now, if you go on the website, there is a little calculator on there. You can put in your flavours that you want. You can put in the, the end product that you want, and it will tell you how much you need to put in your bottle to get to where you want to be. We're going to mix up a standard blend, a 70-30, okay? So, nicotine, the same nasty stuff. If you get it on your hands, wash it off. If you spill it, wipe it up, and then when you're done with it, put it away. So, childproof cap. And, right, I've already worked out the standard mix, and of the nicotine, I need two and a half millilitres. So, little syringe. Make sure it's nice and clean so you don't cross over any flavours or any liquids. So we will pull up two and a half mil. There we go. And then just pop that straight in there. It's as simple as that. There we go. Put your lid back on nice and safe and stick it out of the way. Right. Next one we're going to do is the PG. Now we need 15, 15 and a half mil of this one. So we will get another syringe and we will pull up 15 and a half mil. So we go, that's 10 mil. Straight in. five and a half, so we'll pull it up and then we'll squeeze a bit out until we get to where we're supposed to be. There we go. And drop that straight in. Lovely. Again, with the lid and get it out of the way. Right, now we have the VG. Now this stuff's a bit thicker, it's like syrupy texture to it so it does take a bit of time to get it up into into the syringe so we want nine mil that's all so give it a tug and make sure we've got the right amount nine millilitres pop that one in there as well there we go as easy as that. Now, all we've got to do now is our flavour. So, I'm using my trusty vanilla custard because you know how much I love it. Now, when you get these, remember they are concentrated, don't vape that. All right? it's, it's designed to be mixed. 
So the flavour we need, three mil of flavour. So we'll use a little one to get it into the bowl. And we're going to need three of these. Oh, we've got a few air bubbles in that one, let's try again. There we go, that's one mil. Two. Last but not least, number three. That's it, pop the lid on that, nicely out of the way. Right, put your little dripper tipper in there, pop your lid on it, give it a bit of a shake just to get it all nice and mixed up. And that is it, that is as easy as you like. There is one bottle, standard blend, 70-30, vanilla custard. Now, this needs to be steeped, okay? So just pop it in a cupboard somewhere. Every, you know, every now and again, take the lid off, let it breathe, leave it for, I don't know, mix. You need to leave it for about three days minimum. Um, and then you're good to go, and that is one home mixed vanilla custard. It's not hard, just take your time, make sure you get all your ingredients right, have a go. Thanks for watching.